super shady schools. 187-1997. Uh, you know, Samuel L is a substitute teacher here. This is one of the schools that are just uh, it's so underlining what's happening here. Either you're with it or you're not. And if you're not with it, with this school, you could be end up on the outside in a very in a ditch somewhere. That's how gangster this shit is. Uh, this this school just seems so grimy and gritty too as well. Very dark and dense and like uh, very hot. That's what I'm looking for. Hot there in this school with a lot of mist. So wow, this school is so shady due to all those factors. The substitute, 1996, uh, Tom Berenger here. He's a substitute teacher. He comes on in to try to straighten shit out uh, after someone gets hurt that he knows close to him. He wants to get justice basically for an injustice. And uh, man, this substitute teacher in this school. And, and in this school, when he comes to it, it feels so brutal in, in a way. Uh, very quiet though. And if you overstep, you will get hurt in the shady school. That's for sure. It's super shady. Um, you got Mark Anthony as well in the cut. So you know shady shit's happening. Class of 1999, 1990. Uh, you know, when you got robots or androids coming on into your school. And this school's a menace, man. This school's got a lot of narcotic use going on. A lot of bad language. A lot of fights. Uh, a lot of gangs. Uh, man, wow. This school I would not like to go to. The environment school. I really like how they pull it off. But I just would not like to go there. It's so scary. A lot of graffiti on the walls. Uh, vandalism happening. These droids want to stop that in class in 1999. And this school is just super shady due to all those factors. Higher learning, 1995. Now I'm going to switch schools a little bit. Go to a college school. Uh, now in this college school here, what happens is really higher learning. Uh, how to set yourself higher in learning, not just about academics, but life and people. And if you don't, uh, bad shit's gonna happen. And this is what happens in higher learning. What a film, uh, very, uh, the differences uh, that separate us, and that you think separate us, and you make them a big deal. And that's what it becomes in higher learning. So let's learn a little bit about humbleness in higher learning and uh, some love. Damn, this super shady school. I would not like to go to it. Shit happens when you don't expect. Uh, you expect to learn just get A pluses, you're getting F's, and boy, you're fucking bombing due to partying and getting wrapped up in the wrong people. Scream 2, 1997. I'm going with Scream 2 for this. This is a another college school here, Windsor College. And I'm going with this college because the killer comes out of this college in, in, in Windsor uh, here in Scream 2. So I really like how shady, super shady it is due to those factors. And you don't know who's the killer or boyfriend. Is it Sidney Prescott's boyfriend who's singing in the lunchroom? Eh. Or is it, you know, some Top Gun shit? Who knows who the killer is? Is it Randy? Did he go psycho finally? So there's a lot of people and the new people in the school as well. Uh, you don't know who's going to be. So this super shady school has got a killer to hide. And it's Ghostface. Super shady schools.